Okay, all right, so um, we'll go through this video and, and analyze you know, your, your feet, your arms, your head, the mechanics of your running movement. Yeah. You understand? All right, so. Go. Okay, so if we go back into here, and we can see you have decent arm lift okay so arm lift is this here see how high it is mm -hmm. in relation to where your face is that's, a, that's pretty good okay that gives you a good length um, of distance in between your body and your elbow so your knee can come up high all right you understand that what we don't want if we progress it forward see how it comes into your midline see how it's now pointing towards your knee yeah and watch, when we go down there, it's like nearly straight. Coming towards, and it's and it's turned inwards. Your thumb's facing your hip. Yeah. And then it comes back out, and then it gets back to that height, which is good. Okay? All right, what we, what we don't want to happen is this hunch. So remember in the lunges and the warm-up, I told you to keep your back straight. You've got to consciously now think about keeping your back up tall. All right? Doesn't mean you can't lean over from the hips and, and be that motion. At the moment, you're this. Okay? We need you to be a little bit more, um, a, little bit, a little bit straighter from your point of your, the point of your shoulder to your hip. It needs to be a straight line. And as you can see there, it just curves like that. All right, we've got to get that fixed up fairly quickly. The next thing we need to do is increase your knee height. So if we go back over here, so that's as high as your knee gets, okay? Which that needs to be that height. In line with your hip it doesn't really get that high ever but the higher we can get it the better it is for your lower limb to have a lot more room than to land here or land out here okay so if we if we lift that leg up higher this one comes a th through a lot more is able to land somewhere out here you understand that so we're, we're going to look at high knees we're going to look at strengthening your um, adductors and hip flexors which are muscles and ligaments in this part of your body in your hip so then it's that you're able to bring your knee up higher oh you're able to bring your knee up higher that way okay um, the next thing is the last thing is our uh, second last thing sorry is your feet see how they land flat yeah. okay let's zoom into here and see how they land flat, it's, it's actually heel first. See how it's your heel, mm -hmm. and then your foot rolls in. Yeah. All right, what we need you to do is make sure you land with your toes. See how it's kind of striding out. So um, this part here is coming outwards. And needs to be, it needs to be bang and then bang. Okay, see how it's so low? Yeah. See how it's down first? And it goes down there. It needs to be like that. Like that? Yeah. And then your foot, see how your foot's facing upwards? Your foot needs to face up like it is there, right? But we need it to be on your toes. We need your toe to touch first. On the, on the floor on the ground, not your heel. All right, so there's a couple of things that we need to go through with this. Um, I'll send this to your dad mm -hmm. um, through our YouTube site, um, and then you can watch it and watch it and watch it, understand and remember before you come to training what we're going to be working on because we're doing those sprints at every session, and then we'll get into the hurdles and stuff afterwards, like we've all now. Do you understand that? You sure? Are you sure? Yeah. All right. Okay. So I'll I'll um I'll, I'll get put this up to tonight, and then you can have a look at it. Okay. On your website. 
Yeah, on the, on the YouTube channel. 